UGC's Halo Classic wrapped up, and it was a pleasure to see Halo 3 retake the stage as veterans and new pros alike competed for their share of the $35,000 prize pool. In the Grand Finals, we see Tox Gaming take the main stage against Denial Esports for some serious nail biters. Game 1 of the series saw the two teams face off on the pit CTF where the game went into overtime and Denial clutched the win after a near 22 minutes. He's gonna have the flag, no one's gonna be there to stop him and Denial will draw first blood! With the help from Denial's coach Callus, let's take a closer look at how Denial utilized spawn positions and proper target selection to capture the flag for an overtime victory. With just over 9 minutes left, Tox have just finished clearing out their Mauler side and begin a 2-1-1 push towards Overshield. APG and Lethal push Training, Eco in the tower as an anchor, and Snakebite pushing Runway. Denial responds in a similar 2-1-1 format, but with a twist. Using the Overshield as a distraction, Ares will make his way for a sneaky flagpole through Long Haul, while commonly grabs a new sniper on S1 to support Shelly and Straight Sick as they fight for the Overshield. Shelly pushes into customs for the overshield spawn, soaking bullets and attention from APG and Ego. APG chases Shelly to deny the OS, but Straight Sick is there for support, delaying for Shelly. He takes out APG before dying to Eco, all the while Shelly gets a huge kill on Snakebite just before OS spawns. Commonly gets the kill on Lethal, and Denial have overshield and man advantage. Now's the time to push. With the positions that Denial have at this point, they know that Tox will spawn on their Mauler side. Shelly, with the overshield, pushes into Tox's courtyard, pinching Eco with commonly, staggering Tox's respawns. While Ares attempted a flag pull, Snakebite was able to quickly take him out after spawning in, but that left him wide open for commonly to snipe him with a body shot. Meanwhile, on the other side of the map, Straight Sick has spawned in at his Mauler side and begins to push Long Haul working with Shelly to pinch Tox's flag. Shelly takes out APG and commonly anchors Tox's sword ramp to force Tox's spawns. Shelly is sitting at about half overshield when Lethal spawns back in to contest. At this point, Straysick is pushing long haul, focusing fire on Snakebite. Luckily earlier, commonly hit that body shot, giving Straysick a double kill on Snakebite and Lethal. Shelly pulls the flag, and Straysick immediately pushes Tox's mauler. This, along with commonly at sword ramp, traps them into spawning in their courtyard and snipe tower, allowing Ares and commonly to fight off Tox as they respawn in. Based on the comms from his teammates, Shelly switches his route to long haul so as to give him extra space to run the flag all the way home and claim the overtime victory. That shield back, he's gonna have the flag, no one's gonna be there to stop him and Denial will draw first blood and they will take game number one here in the grand final versus Tox.